Hello and welcome to the Zim JavaScript Canvas Framework. We're going to show you some examples of Zim and you can find Zim at zimjs.com. I am Dr. Abstract. Let's go to the site now and zimjs.com and press on examples and we're on our last one on the first row. Nope, that there's more examples, but we'll take a look at particles. Particles done with the emitter class, and as we sort of scroll over, this is a menu. Look at that strange particle effect that we're getting. Isn't that cool? So, here are some examples of particles. There you go, we're running at 60 frames per second, and we're spitting out all these particles, and then they're curving in on themselves. That's with a sink, so we've got this sink which tracks the particles in behind. Cool. Uh, going back to the menu, this one is a famous particle thing, snowflakes. And what we've done is we've swirled the snowflakes a bit with a sink that moves about with this class called a wiggle class. And you can press on those snowflakes and see what they look like. We just quickly made those snowflakes. <laughs> but it's neat that the particle emitter can emit a snowflake making function. So that is cool. You can see the code and how to do that. This one is Nido Mosquito. It's flames. Oh, another famous one. And you can press this and it changes the color of the flames. Isn't that cool? Oh, the pink flames. Nice. Whoosh. And then maybe the most famous of all fireworks, in which case we didn't put a sound in here. There you go. So different types of fireworks going there. And from little particle ones like that, or that was a big particle one, to lines. So you can also emit things that make lines. And you can view the code to see what's in there, what the particles are um, like. There's circles and randoms in the end. You'll see that we've got, oh, where is it? Where, oh, where? Shoot is the emitter. So that's the emitter that makes the streak going up. And uh, let's see if we go back to the menu here. Here's an example of lines being made. So we'll click the activate. Ooh, isn't that pretty? Sort of atomic-like lines. And the last one under here is uh, falling particles. So using it to make particles that fall. Neat. That is the particle emitter here at Zim in the examples. And you can find Zim at zimjs.com along with all sorts of tutorials on how to make these things and bubbling videos about what's new. So we hope you come and learn how to code or if you've coded already, code on the canvas. It's amazing. It's a great way to learn. Very visual and a lot of fun. I am Dr. Abstract. Have a great day or night. Ciao.